I'll tell you a funny story though about the band plays out here usually and our boat company. Sometimes there's two boats cruising into here. That would be the second of those two boats. But this part we ended up losing all motor control. I don't think y'all know anything about boats. It's a very bad thing. Actually, the crashing in that island we just went around. The funny thing about this though, guys, is the fact the band was out there playing live at the time. They saw this happen, cut out the music they were playing at that time, and played them the Titanic song instead. That was pretty funny, Miss Oliver. Alright guys, now back in 1968 though, the city of San Antonio received a gift from Portuguese. This gift was two statues of Sydney, also known as San Antonio. These statues does reside on the grounds of the Americanic Courthouse. The other one though, guys, coming up right over here to the right hand side as we exit from the East Lake Bridge. I zoomed in on this beer while I go. The question is having so much fun. Guys, 7 foot tall bronze statue of San Anthony. After the Portuguese made that statue and the one on the grounds of the Americanic Courthouse, the one for Paul to him. So now the only two statues in existence, know, identical to that one, from the Portuguese in the world. Well, I see there a patron saint here in San Antonio, but he's also the patron saint of Portugal. The reason why they made the statues came best during that time. The way we got our name, though, here in the city, as back on June 13, 1691, we'll a Spanish Catholic Mass it's, it's on the like natural portion of the river. Since June 13, 1691, it had to be the feast day of St. Anthony, the one had named the river San Antonio. Shortly thereafter, it ended up with the exact same name. So we got our name here in the city. It's nice, simple, and easy. <laughs> I'm not sure if he does. He does now, I think. Uh, sure. yeah, if you would do guys, go ahead and take a look yeah, off to the right hand side and uh, through the trees. You'll notice this church that's up here on the street, though. I wish I could zoom in on the street. Guys, that is St. Joseph's Church. Built back in 1868, and it's a German Catholic church. It's the first church that was built here in San Antonio after the Battle of the Alamo. On the fourth Sunday of any given month, they do hold a traditional German Catholic Mass with an all male German speaking choir. But no one looks like, please don't forget to visit them on that fourth Sunday. Do not ask me, because I have no clue. They're I can't imagine how much video he's got, because I've also got a lot of like 10 minutes of video, although I'm sure he can hear me talking. Hey, Boyle can hear me talking. As they crossed the Atlantic by boat back in the 1800s. Now, guys, back in 1900. Guys, that hotel is known as the Hilton Palacio del Rio Hotel, the Palace of River. Now, Mr. Hilton asked that hotel be completed in 10 months, more or less than about 500 rooms. A pretty big challenge trying to fulfill. Only one company actually accepted Mr. Hilton on this bit of a challenge. That was H.B. Zachary Company. As you know, though, guys, H.B. Zachary Company, from the day they broke ground to the day they opened up their doors, only took a grand total of 202 working days to build this hotel. That is Jones' grand total of about eight months. The way they were able to accomplish this, they built the first four floors and the elevator shaft here on site. At the exact same time, the rest of the floors are completed eight miles south of us in the simple line fashion. After each was completed eight miles south of us, we brought them up here on trucks, completely furnished. All the way down to the beds being made, the tiles on the racks, and the pictures on the walls. I can get you. And some of them, just like Legos, but stack them on top of the other ones. And still, to this day, the world's tallest and fastest modular built building. But, ladies and gentlemen, that does conclude my tour, though, for this evening. I hope you enjoyed yourselves. I know I have. 
a couple things up before I get done. So one please make sure you tell us that it's safe the other next I really don't want any accidents to happen. Two, there are some coupons back to those ticket stubs. These are for use at their designated locations. And three, for a job well done at Drive Servio San Antonio Cruises, we will appreciate y'all's tips. Hope you have a wonderful day, guys, and please safe journey home. Here we go. <laughs> 